What's up everybody, Why Davis here, back with another review. Today I'm gonna be showing you guys the Air Force One Halloween Premium. Now before I get into the video, I just wanna say thank you guys for all the support. Keep on liking, keep on subscribing, and it really motivates me to keep going when I see you guys liking my content. Also, it lets me know I'm in the right direction of showing you guys what you wanna see. If you're new to the channel, I just wanna say thank you and welcome. I drop a lot of dope content here, so consider subscribing. Also, there's a 4K video playing in the background of me, and you guys with a news video was coming ahead of time if you follow me on Instagram, at Davis. Also, don't forget to turn on that notification bell. I drop videos damn near every week. So let's get right into it, guys. On this box right here, it's just a black box. At the top of the box, it says Nike Air Force. One there, and like a silver finish. Pretty dope in my opinion. I did go with a size 9.5. Retail on this was 130. Now, resale is currently going for about 150. And these are soon to drop on sneakers in like the middle of November sometime. I forgot the date, but I don't know why they didn't come out in October because they are Halloween shoes. But let's get right into it, guys. So we open up this box here and we get like some white paper with like some detailed stars here, which we also get on the bottom of the shoe right there, which is pretty fire in my opinion. Um, any shoe that says PRM on it or SE, meaning special edition, we always get better quality on those type of shoes. And I noticed that we always get like some very detailed bottoms too, like on the stars or wherever shape the bottom comes in. But let's get right into it, guys. So we get this a beautiful, amazing shoe, which also glows up around the inside here. Just a bunch of eyes all the way around the shoe, which is pretty dope, pretty fire. Even that big eye right there on the back. Pretty hot in my opinion. Make sure you guys get yourself a UV light if you guys ever want to see things glow up in the dark faster or just trying to check your shoes out on the spot. Cost about 10 bucks. Um, but yeah, let's get right into it. So on the bottom of the shoe, it's an orange. It just says Nike with a check there. And then that's an orange all throughout the bottom of the shoe. And then we get those detailed stars at the top of the bottom of the shoe. All right, coming up to the missile, we get that orange creeping up it a little bit. Then we get the white going around the midsole with the air being an orange. And then we get that black line going across the outside. Show you guys the outside first. Now I'm gonna show you guys the inside. Okay, then we get that white stitching as well. All right, now coming a little bit higher than that, we get like an all black leather around this shoe which then we get those eyes on here. Without a black light, it just looks like a tracing of eyes. It's like kind of hard to see with the naked eye, but you can see it if you like look very, very closely. And then when you hit the flashlight or the UV light on it, it starts to glow up. Okay, now this is the best way to charge your shoes up if you're in a hurry without paying them into a light, once again. Okay, we're going on to the toe box of the shoe. We get some black leather right there, which is pretty nice, pretty soft. Put my hand on it so you guys can see what I'm talking about. Pretty nice. I am gonna put my uh, force fill in these shoes when I do wear them because creases are gonna be a problem with this shoe and I suggest you guys to do the same. Okay guys, so I'm gonna show you guys how good this piece actually is. I'm gonna put it in my right shoe so you guys can see what I'm talking about and why I wear these all the time. All you do is push it all the way in the bottom of your shoe. Put it on for you guys. And right, the left shoe, I do not have it in, right? So watch the left shoe. See how nasty and creased that looks right there? that I get to bend this see and this one okay nothing look at that look at the difference see the difference right shoe big difference big difference so here's with the front of the shoes. When you put the light on them, I'm gonna put the UV light on it so you guys can see them recharged up. But this is what it looks like in the front of the shoe when it's charged. Just a whole bunch of eyes going to the front. I'm gonna turn the left shoe so you guys can see what the outside of the left shoe look like. Okay. Boom. Just a whole bunch of eyes, which is pretty fire. I'll show you guys the back shoes here fire bro
it looks like. Um, on the front of the mud guard here, we get like those little eyes right there again. Okay, and then a white on the bottom of that. Okay, coming to the side of the shoe, all black tumble leather looks like with the black swoosh on the outside, pretty dope in my opinion. Same thing on the inside. All right, with those eyes right there. Pretty nice, pretty nice. Now we only get one pair of laces with these. They come in black laces. Okay, and at the bottom of that, we get a Nike check right before we get up to the laces. Okay, then we get an orange mesh tongue. And then on top of the mesh tongue, we get it, it says Nike Air in black up there. Pretty dope. Okay, now on the inside of the shoe, it's all orange. And then on the insole, it has a spider and it says Nike with the logo in black. Show you guys that right there. Pretty nice. All right, show you guys the back of the shoe here. Just says Nike Air back there in black. Okay. Dope. Now I did wind up going a half a size up on these because I do wear force fields in my side of my shoes. But when you guys get these, you can go true to size. They do run true to size. Um, that's just a personal preference of mine. But I'm gonna show you guys what these look like on feet. Like, comment, subscribe, show your boy some love and stay tuned. Thank you. 